all your information out and uh, where people can contact you, what other kind of things you're getting involved with, and so forth and so on. Yeah, absolutely. Um, let's see. Also, I was just going to say this, that we're going to be working on a new type of TV show, and it's going to be pretty cool. Um, I can't really mention the working title yet, but uh, they're going to be shooting for one of the major networks. Um, but it'll be based on, it's, you know, characters and stuff that could be across the board of all the different fields of normal to paranormal uh, type of situations, which basically have to use some kind of technology to help solve the problem. So it could be some, something regarding a normal state. In other words, you know, what can you, what can you kind of come up with to solve this type of problem? Some kind of, say some, some kind of investigation or something, but using some kind of technology tool set. And then you come across a case that it's a paranormal situation, maybe something cryptozoology related, could be ghost related, could be, um, um, you know, uh, UFO related. So in other words, kind of like I, what what's something new tool set that you could come up with that we could really try to get get a real data and information you know, trying to close the case. That's what they want. That's that's what the show is going to be based on. What methods and tools you could come up with that could kind of close, prove or disprove that this situation exists, <laughs> or close it, like a CSI is paranormal, something like that. Oh, that's fantastic. So that's that's the works um, going to be involved with that, uh, and I keep you guys posted on it. Um, of course, the NDA, non-disclosure agreements and stuff, they, they don't want to release the, the working title yet until uh, yeah. everything is uh, legally done, uh, you know, approved and stuff. But yeah. um, it, it's definitely, it's so, it, so it's really, really, uh, the way I look at it, if, um, I mean, I'm, I love some of the, some of the searching for Bigfoot shows and stuff, but, you know, it's funny, It's even the ghost, the traditional ghost hunter show is like, you guys, you need, you need to, you know, you need to retool or you need to, like, there's got to be some more action, <laughs> interaction, something going on, you know. Um, <laughs> it's just basically getting too dried out, and it's, it's you know, you start to lose interest real quick. Yeah. I mean, oh, I can't to the state penitentiary uh, with the same, oh, you know, with the K2 meter is on the come on. You know, you got you got to be more inventive than that now. So this is what the show wants to do. Mm-hmm. It wants to do is really be creative, come and have some kind of real interaction, something going on um, where you could, uh, you know, prove or disprove whatever. And, um, you know, sometimes it's hard to collect some kind of data, but that's what, that's what they want to put. They're going to push, push us to do, you got to come out with something. You gotta come out with something. Okay, you said this mm-hmm. person talks talks from this gray stone or something. You gotta come up with something to prove or disprove that you can get that data. <laughs> so it's gonna be real challenging, but it should be a lot of fun. Oh, it definitely sounds like a blast. Sounds like a yeah, it sounds like a blast, and I, I I wish you the best with that project. Thanks, man. Appreciate it. So yeah, if you got if they if you could send me a simple email, I mean um, I'll just give you know, one of my straight old emails where you know they could they contact me, they get any questions or they want to share some ideas, or they even get some cases and stuff or heard of cases. But they're all great out there. They're all like I say every single the song I call it the sciences uh, are fantastic as far as intriguing. You know everything from Mothman to Everything else is just an incredible amount of discovery and ex- exploration yet to solve. <laughs> you know, I mean, people yeah. are not everyone is crazy out there, and people have legitimate, you know, right, legitimate um, observations and experiences. And uh, so you need professionals and people like yourself and people to help these other people out. But not everyone's crazy out there, and that all. <laughs> 
<laughs> it's schizophrenic. Yeah. It's just basically there is some there's some truth to some of this substance out there. This, I think there's a little uh, mental thing out there. It's just over time, I mean, things tend to get blown out of proportion, and and that's where the yeah. problem is coming. It's not that it's not real. It's just the story right. has been changed so much over the course of time that you got to try to figure out what is real and what is not real. Yeah. Um, it, it's been a pleasure having you on. And uh, yeah, on that note, Danny, why don't we cut the break and uh, we will greet this young fellow all. Sounds great. And then I'll come back for the uh, full two hours uh, on another, another venture and uh, we'll go into some The Can Coaching Center is a proud sponsor of DTM Wicked Radio Network. What would it mean to you to have better health, more energy, more vitality, and an all-around better life? At the Caring Coaching Center, our mission is to be your partner in helping you reach your health, fitness, and lifestyle goals. We do this through a dynamic six-month program that helps our clients reach their goals and their full potential. And it all starts with a free, no-obligation, 50-minute health history consultation. Rolling Hills Asylum. Located in East Bethany, New York, just minutes between two major airports, Rolling Hills Asylum is a hotbed of paranormal activity. They have been featured on travel channels, ghost adventures, paranormal challenge, as well as sci-fi channels, ghost hunters. Rolling Hills Asylum has been named the number two most haunted location in the United States by HauntedNorthAmerica.com. The property was established on January 1st, 1827 as the county poor farm. Throughout the years, it has operated as a poor farm, infirmary, orphanage, tuberculosis hospital, nursing home, and more. Past residents and inmates consist of widows, orphans, physically disabled, mentally unstable, murderers, and more. Over 1,700 bodies are buried in unmarked graves, and hundreds more deaths went undocumented. Rolling Hills Asylum is known for a plethora of phenomena, including disembodied voices, doors slamming, footsteps, sounds of furniture moving, full-body apparitions, shadow people, ghostly touches, and numerous Class A EVP. Rolling Hills Asylum proudly offers historical and flashlight tours, four- and eight-hour public ghost hunts, eight- and nine-hour private ghost hunts, and more by appointment or pre-booking only. For more information, please visit www.rollinghillsasylum.com. That's www.rollinghillsasylum.com. Or give them a call, 585-502-4066. That's 585-502-4066. Rolling Hills Asylum. What are you doing this weekend? Hello? Hello?
do believe in spooks. I do, I do, I do believe in spooks. The Can Coaching Center is a proud sponsor of DTM Wicked Radio Network. What would it mean to you to have better health, more energy, more vitality, and an all-around better life? At the Caring Coaching Center, our mission is to be your partner in helping you reach your health, fitness, and lifestyle goals. We do this through a dynamic six-month program that helps our clients reach their goals and their full potential. And it all starts with a free, no-obligation, 50-minute health history consultation. Just visit us. We now rejoin a typical paranormal investigation already in progress. Welcome back, friends, to hour number six of our one-room colonial farmhouse investigation. We have a new group joining us, so let's get right to it. Sir, would you like to ask a question? If there's someone here with us, can you please give us a sign of your presence? Very good, very good. And you, young lady, I see you have some dousing rods there. Can you cross these for yes and separate them for no? Well done! And you there, in the generic black shirt group t-shirt, is there something that you'd like to know? Yeah. How was them pilgrim chicks in the sack? <laughs> Tired of the same old, boring paranormal shows? Then come join the party. Paranormal After Party chronicles the exploits of the generic black shirt group, a team of paranormal investigators that uncover the serious and sometimes lighter sides of the paranormal. The evidence is real, and the rest is real fun. Find them on the web at www.paranormalafterparty.tv. Don't stop living just because you're dead. The historical Fort William Henry Conference Center and Resort is a proud sponsor of DTM Wicked Radio. If you're looking for a relaxing getaway, the historical Fort William Henry Resort and Conference Center is your destination. Come enjoy the beautiful mountains, the gorgeous lake, and everything Lake George has to offer in upstate New York, right off the Adirondack Mountains. For reservations, you can go to www.fortwilliamhenry.com or call one 800 Two three four zero two six seven. The Fort William Henry Resort and Conference Center is your destination for the perfect getaway. We now rejoin a typical paranormal investigation already in progress. Welcome back, friends, to hour number six of our one-room colonial farmhouse investigation. We have a new group joining us, so let's get right to it. Sir, would you like to ask a question? If there's someone here with us, can you please give us a sign of your presence? Very good, very good. And you, young lady, I see you have some dousing rods there. Can you cross these for you? 